Hello fellow YouTubians on the other side of the screen. I'm your host Gary G and we're gonna finish the little red COVID today. But first as always the riddle. Who had the first patent for a V8 engine? A. Paul Dupont B. Lyon Levavasseur or C. Jean de Monet The answer is always the end of the show. This week we finished the Little Red Covet. We are really happy the way it turned out. The mechanism of the door was kind of challenging but we figured it out. But now any further ado, see what we had down in the garage. First thing this week, we're gonna take care on our dashboard. After we painted the seats in gloss black, they were ready to mount in as well. The door panel should have a little bit of a contrast to the red of the car, so that's why we want to have some white in there as well. After some paint and some details on the car, we are ready for some eye candy! Now, back to the studio. The 
sound of a V8 engine gives the most of us goose pimples. No way to imagine an American muscle car without that specific sound, at least to me. But who had the first patent for that kind of motor? See you in the riddle! Okay, here comes the end of our little Saturday morning show. We hope you had a few nice minutes with us and you'd be inspired for your little weekend project. But now, as always, love and friendship, something you can't buy. Respect all people. Keep that hobby alive. See you next Saturday, folks. The mechanism of the doors was a little bit challenging, but we enjoyed to figure it out. Figuring out? Figuring, figuring, figuring it out. Figuring out. Figuring. Figuring. We figuring it out. <laughs> was a little bit longer than usual so it's almost lunchtime and I want to take the opportunity to something very special a friend of mine that it's kind of sounds crazy we never met but I feel like we have a real strong bondage although we might even never will meet I'm talking about Charlie Mac and uh, this one Charlie is for you Have a toast on good friends on the other side of the planet. Jolly, cheers. Let's toast, let's toast, let's be good friends. See you next Saturday.